guys, it's me, Swimming Pothead, and today we are going to do a very short tutorial on how to download the 7-Zip application that helps you unzip folders and RAR folders and 7-Z folders. Um, and I don't know if you guys ever have come across this, but a lot of people have been asking me, like, what do I do? Um, my, my mod's not working. And it's usually because you move the folder that's zipped into your mods folder instead of unzipping it first because there's actually content in there that needs to be unzipped and moved without being in a zip folder. So I'm going to show you guys how to download this application that allows you to basically download mods and um, CC. So what you want to do is go here and based on whether you have a 64-bit or a 32-bit download that. I have a 64-bit so I'm usually um, one to download that. So I'm just going to download the 64-bit here. They just came out with a 7-zip um, update so that's cool. <laughs> um, so we're going to click download as you can see here. Um, and you wait for it to download down here. And once it's done downloading, you're going to want to open it. Okay, so once it's downloaded, you're going to go and show in folder after clicking the little button. Um, so here you have uh, the 7Z um, application. So you're going to double click on that. And you're going to have, um, do you want to allow this app for any unknown publisher to make changes to your device? You say yes. Um, then you click install right here. And there you go. Um, it's installed, so very quick and easy. Press close. So now what you want to do is um, basically what happens is since it's already downloaded and you right click on one of, this is a zip folder um, that I downloaded. Um, and also, as you can see, these are package files. If it says RAR files, that means that you have to extract it. Um, and open it before putting it in your mods folder until you see package files. And then package files can be moved to your mods folder. So what you want to do to the RAR, if it says RAR, you right click and you see like this little 7-zip here. And then you can click extract here and it's going to extract it. So I'm going to do an example with this zip folder here. So you're going to right click, go into 7-zip and click extract here. And as you can see, when I clicked extract here, you get these two package files right here. So then what you want to do is only move these into your mods folder, what right? What you want to do then is documents. You right click on that. You press open a new window. Then you go into electronic arts, Sims 4 mods. And once you're in the mods, you can go into your clothes. And since they're closed, you just put them in their clothes. So if you're not seeing the 7-zip when you right click on this, um, you also can try double clicking and it also will open the zip folder as well. What you want to do is go into your little magnifying glass and you want to go into 7-zip. And as you can see, it says si <coughs> file manager. So you may not see this um, per se, but what you want to do is find tools and go into options. And as you can see here, um, it says associated, associated with 7-Zip and you just have to, you know, select all of these um, and press OK. And then um, it should show up um, and go back into tools um, and you go into here 7-Zip and you can go into integrate um, this. You want to click that. Um, and you just want to, um, yeah, you just want to, you know, uh, check all of these, you know, um, and yeah, look through here and, um, set your settings will be there and it will like set up and it should show up once you do that. And then you can right click and it should show up here and you can ex always do like extract files here and then just drag and drop whatever shows up. So I hope this was helpful. I came out with this tutorial because a lot of people were asking me like, how do I unzip? You're always talking about unzipping files. Um, so here is a small tutorial on how to do that. I hope it was helpful and keep on simming everyone. Comment section below if you have any questions and the link to the application is in this description below. Have a good day everyone.